let's make a simple chatbot in Rivet. We'll start by adding a chat node as the response from the AI. Right click or press space and type in chat. Press enter to add the node to the graph. Next, add a user input node so you can type messages to the chatbot. Edit the user input node and enable the toggle at the bottom to get its text from a connection. We'll need to pass the full chat history as well as the user's message to the chat node. So, add an assemble prompt node to combine messages. Connect its output to the chat node's prompt. So that we can send multiple messages, add a loop controller at the beginning. The first input of the loop controller will be the last message from the AI. The second input will be the entire chat history. Add a prompt node to form the first message from the AI. Edit it, change the type to assistant, and type in some greeting text. Connect the prompt node to both default inputs of the loop controller. At the beginning, the first message is both the last message from the AI and the entire message history. Connect output 1, the last AI message, to the user input node. Connect output 2, the full message history, to the assemble prompt node. Then connect the response from the user input to the next port of the assemble prompt node to append the user's reply. We need to tag the AI response as an assistant type, so add a prompt node with its type set to assistant and connect the chat node's response to it. Connect the prompt, the last message from the AI, back to input 1 of the loop controller. Add another assemble prompt to assemble the new chat history. Connect the previous assemble prompt and then append the AI's response. Connect this to input 2 of the loop controller. Finally, add a graph output node to break the loop and allow the graph to run. You're done! Press run in the action bar to run your chatbot. Type in your question and press submit. When the AI replies, the user input will appear again with the AI's response. Next, you can experiment to see what kinds of things you can add to your chatbot. Add a system prompt, or generate the initial message using another chat node. The possibilities are endless. Check out the Rivet documentation for more.